my training is is I have an MD and a PhD in economics. I do health health economics for a living. I've been following for the last two decades this this literature, obsessively documenting the returns to education on the health of children during their entire lives. Huh. And, 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 you know, it's, it's pretty convincing. It's a great investment we make when we educate our children in terms of, you know, they, they live longer, healthier, more fulfilling lives. If, if, and even like small, small interruptions of the education is what the, what the literature documented yeah, yeah. have long lifetime consequences. Someone, uh, uh, this guy named Dimitri Kostakis, who's an uh, uh, editor of JAMA Pediatrics, did this really interesting paper. We just extrapolated that existing social science literature and said, well, we closed schools for a short time in, in, in spring 2020. What consequences will that have on the lifetime, lifespans of children? And he estimated that we had essentially robbed children in the United States of five and a half million life years just from the short interruption 